All right, it's Bark back again with another obscure mic production. It's not a obscure mic video, so to speak. Got my crap tangled, bro. Anybody use wireless headphones for a podcast? I don't, never have, but I'm curious now. So anyways, no obscure mic today. Sorry, guys, but there's still going to be something. One, yes, I am talking into a Shure SM7. What? A 7? Just a, uh, Is it an original SM7? Is it an SM7B? No. It's the uh, obscure SM7A. I don't know, man. Guitar Center had one with a, uh, a Heil boom arm for like 289 289 this and a Heil boom arm. They forgot to send me the boom arm, and then they said the boom arm was bent to hell and back. So they sent me a free brand new Rode PS1A. PSA1? PS something. Great deal. So I'm using the SM7A. Growing on me. The, the, this is growing on me. I wasn't sure about it, but this is that's not what the video is about. The video is about what's in my hand. Uh, it is about quick release adapters. We've got the um, on stage quick release adapter. We've got the Gator Frameworks quick release adapter. And we've got the Gravity quick release adapter. Bronson kind of got me onto these. Cough drop in. Allergies. Bronson got me onto these with the uh, on stage quick release. I had heard about them, but seeing him use one on a video, I was like, 10 bucks? Yeah, sure. I get that in. I'm like, it's pretty cool, but I bet there's a better design. Then I grabbed the Gravity for $12.99 off B&H. We'll get to that. Then my curiosity was still piqued. So I grabbed the Gator Frameworks off Amazon, I think, for 1953. I got it pulled up right in front of me. 1953. Very specific. So I got these uh, quick release adapters. Want to put them to the test. Let you know which one I think is best. Better than the rest. It's not incest. They all love each other, but they're all different. I went on a little rhyming rampage if you didn't notice. So let's take a look at these things. Let's lay them all out on the table and cut to a different video. Okay, so we're going to start out with the on-stage quick release. And it is very basic, all black, shorter than the others. Probably smaller in stature all the way around. Thinner, shorter, that's what she said. You've got a little push button here that you push down to release the top end. So that's that's where your mic's going to be connected. And then to put it back on, you just press the button again and slide it over top like so. Now, moving on, we've got the gravity. This is more of a, uh, this is a little more intricate. You don't have a button. You've got a slider, like a slider phone. This is a little heavier. You can tell it's a, a lot more heavy duty. The 3 8 inch adapter on it comes off. You can go to the smaller, um, oh, what, 5 8 3 8 So the smaller 3 8 so it's got a 3 8 to 5 8 inch adapter. That could be convenient, possibly, maybe. And it's only a couple bucks more. And then you slide down the slider there and you pull off a small piece that goes into the microphone. So we'll slide that back on just like that and locked tight, tight like a toyga. Cough drop. Now let's go on to the Gator Frameworks. This is easily the beefiest, heaviest, and most substantial of the three. 
again you got a slider you slide that down instantly reveal this nice beautiful red ring and you pull out the mic adapter now the mic adapter has what looks like a allen wrench style uh connection on it the thing i like about this is you can buy uh in packs of like four and five i think maybe more you can buy more of these so you can have your mics you can have four or five mics ready to go with this connector in and just pop it in lock it and go that's an advantage to me that's an advantage i like that a lot so there you go we've got the three laid out before you that's what they look like it's almost like smallest to biggest and it also is smallest to biggest in price range you got 10.99 uh 1299 well 1053 whatever we'll just say 11 13 and 20 and the size matches the price so now let's put them on a mic stand and see what we got all right so i'm gonna leave my mic up pretty high so we can kind of see this i'm not gonna get all up close on it since we just did that with the three mic adapters but for quickness and ease, 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 ease of use, let's just see first the on stage mic adapter. Push the button, slide up. Pretty quick, pretty easy. Now, sliding back down, you got to push the button again, and now we're locked back in. So, not bad that's okay i'm okay with that solid 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 let's move on to the next one all right now let's do the same test with the 13 dollar gravity mic coupler so as you can see we're solid we're on and with this one all you got to do you can grab two hands that's what she said and simply pull down and release now to me that was easier than the on stage. Can we just snap it back in? No, you still have to go down like that. Good to go. But again, super fast release and mounting is pretty quick too. As long as you're ready to go with two hands. I like that. That's pretty solid for just a couple more dollars. I think that easily uh, takes over the on stage quick release so the gravity so far has moved into the pole position let's check out the gator frameworks okay so now we have the gator frameworks quick release i lost my uh, windscreen but as you can see we're locked and loaded good to go there two hand method again just like we had with the gravity so let's pull it off like houdini right out she goes got that allen style head that i really like does it just go back in no still two-handed you got to put it back in just like that not as quick because you have to line up the allen head so you could miss the first time so quickness gravity out of all three, on a quickness scale of which one releases faster and mounts faster, you got the gravity. So for live use, there you go. On stage live use, if that's what you're looking for, the gravity is the way to go. And it's $8 cheaper than the Gator Frameworks. Are we done? No, we're not done. Again, locked and loaded, quick release. Got to kind of get it back in there you got to line it up still fairly quick probably about the same as the on stage as far as quickness goes but for podcasting um anything not live and on stage for double the price of the on stage and about six dollars more than the gravity 
I, I kind of prefer this because I could buy the adapters and put on multiple mics and then just take off, put on, put on, whatever. So the beefiness is nice too. It's built really well, but so is the gravity. But then you got the gravity with that three eighths to five eighths. Some people may prefer that. Some people may not. This is tough between these two. These are both fantastic. And listen, for the price, I mean, this this is fine. This is decent. It's cheaper. And, and, and you know it's cheaper when you hold them all up at the same time. But it's still nice. If, if you need, you know, three of these for a three-man podcast, sure. Go ahead. Ten bucks piece, 30 bucks total. Ah, man, that's tough. I really like, I really do like that Allen head feature that you can buy multiple of because they sell them in packs and, and you can just do a bunch of them. But this is one tough decision. For the price and it being so tough, I, I think we got to give the winner to the gravity. The gravity quick coupler. Still, it's super fast. Super, super fast. This is a great option too, though. They're all good options. Gravity is my, that's tough. It's my preferred. I'll just go with it. It's my preferred. This is sweet. So if money's not an object, go with the Gator Frameworks. If money is an object, this is great. The gravity is great. If money is an object. Really cool. I enjoy them. I'm glad I have one of each. I'll use them all. Obscure mics. Hopefully this helped if you are uh, looking for a quick release. Like I was. Still a tad slow on that one. Obscure mics. Peace out.